I'm Lisa Tamafono and I am an independent notes consultant and today I'm going to talk about our spray mop attachment. Now first up, just a quick talk about our mop system. Our mop system, I can't rave about this enough, makes mopping so much easier, uh, a whole heap of less stress when it comes to mopping, there's no lugging of buckets, the pads are easy to put in the wash to clean, you use it with just water, it doesn't take up very much space in your house, in your laundry, for storage. Yeah, and it's got an adjustable handle, so there's no more back breaking, mopping. I wanna talk about, we've got a spray attachment. Now I released this a couple of years ago, and what blew my mind was, I find our mop system so easy to use, as is, but when they released the spray attachment for it, what, it just got easier. So let me show you, first of all, you need to fill it up with only water. This is made to be used with only water. And to get the water in there, you just need to yuck, tug this bit out. So you just hold here, hold here, and pull. Out it comes. Now there was a little bit of water in there because I have been using it. This bit here just screws off. And you just fill it up with water. It's so easy. Screw that back on. Now before I put this back on, I'm going to attach this to our mop system. And show you how it's done. So you're going to need to kind of get to the, the bottom of your mop. You need to remove this part first. So this is the base. Now to do that, you need to push these two buttons and pull this off. So just like so. Put that down. Now on your map, mop attachment, spray attachment. Now that noise, there's a spring inside and that's what makes the water come out. So don't freak out when you hear that noise. You've got these two buttons here. Line it up with this part and pop it back on. So I'm just going to have to turn it upside down. Water is inside. Whoops, it's only water. And so you need to do this once and then you can leave it on. Just push those in until it clicks, right? Now I can turn it up the right way. And I'm just going to attach mop pad back on. So we're just going to, same thing, push the two buttons, line it up with the holes and let it click in. Now you can attach the water. To do that, I'm just going to do this in the air, but you can probably do it on the ground. See this curved bit? that goes along the pole. So that goes along the pole as so, and just got to pop it in and it makes a pop noise. It's on. Now, just to use it, obviously, first of all, you need to adjust the handle to your height, so it's chin height, and make sure you tighten it quite well. So right is to tighten it. Make sure that's nice and tight. Now, when you want water to come out, you need this to be straight up and down, not an angle, straight up and down because you're just going to give it a pump by pushing down gently on that handle so just pump it down and you can hear the water's coming out so the water will just come out the front here there's a little hole here and that's where the water's coming out pump 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 as much as you need and mop away you go now what's cool about that is if you've got a big floor area you don't need to stop and take the pad off and wet it if it gets a bit dry you can just pump some water or if you're like me, I like to have it ready to go. If there's a spill or a mess, I'm ready to go. I can just go and mop the floor. Or if you just want to mop your floor, especially like in the bathroom and that, just makes it all a bit easier. So yeah, that's it.